Hi guys, welcome to Lake District. We've uh, just stopped off in Keswick at the moment. I'm out with uh, Adam and Suggy. Uh, we're out for a two-nighter, heading over to Enderdale Water for the first night. I haven't really decided where we're going to spend the second night to uh, see what uh, the weather brings. Uh, it's not looking too bad at the moment, a uh, bit grey, but no rain as yet. Forecast not looking too bad, which is a good thing. So yeah, uh, I'm going to head over to Enderdale uh, shortly when uh, Adam and Suggy get back. They've just gone out for get some uh, supplies. So, uh, not sure about the second night. Might do two nights over Enderdale. Not too sure yet. We haven't really, uh, haven't really got a plan. But we'll see how it goes. So yeah, I'll bring you back later. Hey guys, we're at Enderdale. Just set off walking. I don't know where camp is to be fair. Uh, Suggy seems to know, so yeah. Just following the, uh, the road down at the moment that runs along the side of the water. Uh, I'll bring you back when we get to camp. Great views. What's on there? That's the top end of uh, Enderdale Water. It's a lovely day for a change. It really does make a change for it not to be raining for us. Yes. We're heading down that way into the woods at the moment. Well, we're, uh, we're camping in the woods, pretty much. So, all pitched up. We're Next to the river. Uh, bit of a shelter going on down there as well. But I uh, tell you what, it's a bloody midge fest. Midges everywhere. So, see how bad it gets tonight, to be fair, because I'm itching like hell and we've only been here about 15 minutes. See how we get on. Well, tent's all set up. On the gazing side, all set up. Second priority, obviously, brew. So, brew kit's on at the minute some water boiled up and I'll be on a happy bunny. And we've got, uh, you can see, Suggy's up there, he's got his trail star, and Adam's up there somewhere, he's in like a Cuban tap thing in my bobby, I'll show you that later, it's pretty cool, very lightweight. So yeah, it's a nice little pitch, it's just uh, shin battle midges. I'll take you down there in a bit as well because there's uh, like a communal area that's been uh, built. So I'll take you down there and show you that in a bit as well once I get my brew sorted, obviously. Well, well, the midges have struck straight in my arms. Loads of them. Great bites. Little bastards. Fucking better go away soon. I see it's a communal shelter that's been built. It's pretty cool. So, spend the night here. Oops. Nice bench. Fire pit. Somebody's left some uh, gear here from last time. It's pretty cool though. Pretty massive beetle. Adam's going all out as well. Salmon and scallops and samphire. <laughs> have some and what, what do I have? <laughs> Pasta gabanara. <laughs> Living the dream. Fuck off. Just take you up to where others are camped. Suggy's into Trail Star, which is a very nice bit of kit. Masses of room under there. Looking good. Massive. Adam's over here. He's in his uh, Cuban fibre posh tap. It's good. Big bag as well. Nice bit of kit that. Really light, packs down really small. I'll see if I get a picture of it tomorrow when it's uh, packed down, but it packs down to absolutely no. Uh, yeah. 
nice pictures. And then down there, and right down there, not many flat pitches to be quite honest around here, so get where we can. But if I'd have known we were in woods, I'd have probably got an hammock. There's plenty of places to sling an hammock. Yeah. Hey guys, um, back in my tent now. All tucked up in my sleeping bag. It's been a good night. It's been nice, uh, nice to have a little communal area with a bit of a fire going. It's, uh, you can't beat a, can't beat a campfire, can you really? But, uh, yeah, it's been a good, it's been a good night. Weather's been good for us. Apart from bloody midges, they've been a pain in the ass. But, this is what you get in it really in the uh, woods next to a water source. Not much we do there. Don't know what I've got planned for tomorrow yet. So uh, we haven't really haven't really decided to be quite honest. I had a quick look at the maps but I am really not sure where, where we're going so see where tomorrow tomorrow takes us. But uh, yeah it's about half past eleven I'm gonna put my head down now because I'm shattered. So I'll catch you in the morning. Right, well, we're heading off now. Left the shelter as we found it. The next uh, people that uh, want to use it. Thanks for that. Well, we're on our way, heading back towards car. We're going to do cat bells uh, later on, just crossing this bridge. So clear is this water, I could show you. It's lovely. And look, we've got this mysterious object in the sky behind us. I think it's been known to be called the sun. It's bloody glorious, absolutely glorious. Let's hope it stays like this rest of the weekend. I'll be happy bunny if it does. Hi guys, welcome to Wasdale. So after a lot of fanning about today, uh, trying to work out where we're going to go and lots of uh, stops at different places, we've ended up at Wasdale. So we've uh, been up to the top, to the inn, uh, we've had something to eat there and a few drinks. Uh, it's about half past nine I think now and we've just come back down to Shaw's and uh, found somewhere to pitch up. I got to see. I'll show you in a bit, uh, but absolutely magnificent views. On that way, I'll swing it around. Oh, yeah, that's lovely, is that? Yeah, so we're uh, pitched right, right next to it, which is good. So yeah, I'll uh, I'll take you over to camp in a minute. But uh, absolutely beautiful around here, absolutely beautiful. We've got a bit of a uh, bit of cloud in the sky, but thought we might fit, see some stars tonight, which uh, will be good for a change. So yeah, I'll uh, bring you back in a bit, and I'll show you around camp. Hi guys, it's about uh, quarter past one, I think. Uh, all tucked up in tent now. I've had a Felt like a long day to be quite honest. Uh, spent it driving around loads of places trying to find somewhere to uh, pitch. Obviously, I ended up uh, in Wasdale, so got a nice pitch here, which is uh, nice. And we've had uh, clear skies, which has been excellent because we've been able to see loads of stars, which I've really enjoyed. That's why it's so late to be quite honest because I've just been sat sat staring at stars. For hours, so yeah, uh, 
I were up in Brunel and Axe, a bit of a drive tomorrow, but never mind. Uh, yeah, catch you in the morning, I guess. Morning, guys. Well, we woke up to a uh, absolutely glorious day. It's about uh, half past six. The sun is out, and yeah, the sun is out. Don't you know if you can see that because of the uh, bloody brightness of it, but wow. Wish I was staying another day. Yes, lovely. Wish I could wake up to this every morning. It's cracking, cracking spot. So, yeah. Nobody else is awake. I'm the first one awake this morning for a change. Uh, don't know if we're doing out this morning or we're uh, just heading off back home, but uh, I'll wait until them guys wake up and uh, we'll see. Catch you in a bit. Guys, we're all packed up, uh, ready to roll. Everything's left as we found it. Looking lovely day. Oh yeah, catch you next time.